Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, y'all. I am struggling with my hair during this whole quarantine. It is getting insanely brassy. And like I have been due for a hair appointment for probably two months now. And we're about to go on six months of my hair not being touched by a professional. And uh, I didn't use purple shampoo for the first like three, four months. Besides the point. But <laughs> my hair is getting very brassy. So I have been doing so much research online trying to figure out the best method to make my hair just nice and bright again. It's summer. I want my light hair back. But it's getting really... It's odd. It almost gets like my hair gets dark. I'm sure y'all know what I'm talking about. If you have blonde hair, you understand what I'm saying. So during my research, I came across a girl named Elle and she did a video that involved a lemon and purple shampoo and conditioner. And you know what I had on hand? A lemon and purple shampoo and conditioner. So I was like, I need to try this. Now I'm gonna have her video linked down below in case you wanna see what products she uses, but I'm going to be using the Unite Blonda Shampoo Toning and the Unite Blonda Fix Repair Tone and Seal. This is the conditioner. These were recommended to me by my hairstylist because I guess a lot of purple shampoos don't actually have any toner in them. They're strictly just purple shampoo. Since they have toner in them, I assume that just means they work better than a regular purple shampoo. So if you are in my situation, highly recommend picking these up. If you guys wanna know if this method works, just keep watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let's uh, jump over to my bathroom because uh, that's where this is all going to take place. Hi everyone, welcome to my bathroom. Today we are going to be testing out a DIY that I saw online and we're gonna learn how to tone our hair to perfection during quarantine. So give me one second while I wet my hair. I'll be right back. So the first step was wetting your hair with warm water to open your cuticle. And the next step, we are going to be adding the lemon juice. Now you're gonna apply the lemon juice to the top of your head first and then work your way down to your ends. <laughs> so you just flew down the drain. I hope that's okay. I'm putting the other half of the lemon in my hair now because she liked the half, but I want this to really work. So let's hope this doesn't ruin my hair, but um, I want to be a little extra. We're gonna be really blonde here. You guys, you just <laughs> just hear seeds hitting the ground. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let this sit on my hair for a little bit. She didn't mention letting it sit, but she also didn't mention not letting it sit. So then after I'm gonna let this sit for like 30 seconds, not for a long time, I'm gonna rinse it out and then we're gonna apply the purple shampoo into my hair. I'm also going to pick all of these seeds up from my ground because I don't know if those are supposed to go down the drain. So I'll be right back. Just a heads up, if you have sunburn, the lemon juice and hot water, it hurts. So there's a little warning. So next I'm using United Blonda Shampoo Toning. This was recommended to me by my hairstylist. Okay, so I put some on my hand, I actually put a lot. And she says, start at the top and work your way down with the shampoo. And you're supposed to leave this on for two to three minutes. So I'm gonna leave this on for two to three minutes and then, what the heck, you got, <laughs> got purple shampoo in my nose. I'm gonna leave this on for two to three minutes and then I'm gonna rinse it off. So with um, the magic of editing, We'll be right back. Okay guys, now that my hair feels like straw, I'm going to apply my conditioner. This is a repair and tone and seal conditioner by Unite, it's the Blonda Fix. I really like this stuff. This was on sale when I bought it. There's like 30% off sale, so definitely go look to see if there's one going on right now. I really like their products. But um, they, she only left hers on for a little bit of time, her conditioner. I'm gonna leave mine on for five to 10 minutes. This just always makes the hair, my hair feel really soft, so I kinda wanna get those benefits now that my hair feels like straw, and it's gonna tone it just a little bit more. So she says to apply this to the bottom of your hair first, and then work your way up. Okay guys, so I left the conditioner on for 10 minutes, so I'm gonna rinse out my hair, and then after I'm done rinsing out the purple conditioner, I'm going to put the water on cold, and this will seal up my hair, so I'm just gonna rinse it out with the cold water, seal up the cuticles, and then we should be all done. <laughs> it's been a little bit of a long process, but if it makes my hair very blonde, I am here for it. So let's jump on into this and then I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay guys, I blow dried my hair and I did a full blown photo shoot outside to show you guys the difference between my hair color from before and after. 
and what I've noticed. What I've noticed is that my hair is about a shade or two lighter and it just appears a lot brighter. I hope it's coming across in these photos that I'm showing. You can see that in the first one. My hair, it, it just looks like there's a lot of dark tones in my hair. I'm not even sure why. But I think the lemon really helped like open up my cuticle and let the purple shampoo in. Now, I do wish I got a little bit like a few shades lighter. So maybe I'm going to have to use this method like one or two more times to really get its full effect. Like I said, I had not used shampoo for the first three months of my hair being blonde. And then, you know, I was just using purple shampoo on top of it. It wasn't doing a lot. As soon as I did this lemon trick... That seems to be the key to getting my hair lighter. I know she mentioned that your hair might feel dry after using lemon. However, mine feels great. It's nice and soft. I really give props to my conditioning treatment because during the process, I even said to you guys, my hair like feels like straw, but it's nice and shiny and soft. And I really think that's due to the conditioning treatment. So highly recommend that product. My plan for the future is to do this like two or three more times. However, I did see another method that I'm interested in. So if you guys want me to try out a whole different method and see if that works better, let me know. If you don't care, then I may not risk my hair because that one seems like there's a little bit more risk involved, which is why I tried this one first. But we'll see. If you guys want me to try out another toning method, let me know. Because I know we're all in this together, all of us blondes. And I don't know, maybe some of you brunettes are having problems as well. I also quickly want to mention we finally hit a thousand subscribers. And I am so pumped, you guys. I have been looking forward to this day for a really long time. I think it's so cool that there are a thousand of you watching me. Like... That is mind blowing to me. So I am just so thankful and I just want you guys to all know that that like that has not passed me by. I'm not just like, oh, I hit a thousand whatever. I literally was jumping up and down for joy. My mom was texting, my sister was texting me, like everyone was congratulating me because they know how long I've been trying to hit a thousand subscribers. So I am just so excited for you all to be here. I hope you guys like my videos. Always, always, always leave me video ideas down below. There's just so much makeup and products, beauty products that come out on the daily that I don't always know what one you guys want to see. So I love hearing your recommendations. So leave those down in the comments down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you are new. And I will see you in my next video. Oh, don't forget to follow my Instagram. It's at Casey Elizabeth underscore YT. Would it be one of my videos if I didn't forget to put that in there? But okay, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.